Hello everybody, welcome back to another airport update. In this video, we're gonna be doing an airport update of San Jose uh, in California. Um, so yeah, it's an interesting airport. It's got a good number of uh, international flights and very interesting ones. Um, and this is a suggested airport by a few people, a lot of people to be honest. Um, I'm using the Dulles board as per usual. I'm not using all of it. So the bit you can see, the normally the cargo area that you can see back there, it's got a few planes on. I won't be using that as part of San Jose as well, where I usually have the United Terminal. I won't be using that because San Jose is a lot smaller than uh, Dallas, so I'm just going to be using the main concourse where the usually the international and all the other airlines except United, uh, Air Canada and Frontier leave from. Uh, so yeah, that's what's going to be going on in this update. Uh, but I'm starting on the runway here. We here we have a um, this is a Frontier uh, A320 uh, Neo. Um, he's going to be heading out to Denver. Next here we have a Volaris A320 Neo. He's going to be heading out to Guadalajara. Next here we have an ANA 777-200 in the 2020 livery. Um, he's about to get pushed back for uh, Tokyo Narita. British Airways 777-200, he's, um, he's just arrived in from London Heathrow and is going to be heading back out there. Alaska 737 in the Salmon 30 Salmon livery. Um, he's going to be heading out to um, Everett. Then we have an Alaska A320, he's just arrived in from Portland and is going to head back out there. And just getting ready for departure, we have another Alaska 737. Um, he's going to be heading up to Honolulu later on today. Next, we have a JetBlue A320. Uh, he's just arrived in from JFK and is going to head back up to Boston. Air Canada A321, he's about to head out to Vancouver. American 757-200, he's about to head out to Chicago. Next here, we have an American A321. He's got service out to Phoenix. And last for the Americans, we have an American 737-800 heading out to Dallas-Fort Worth. Moving on to Delta now, here we have a Delta 757-200. Uh, he's going to be heading out to New York JFK. Next, we have a Delta A220, also known as the CS100. Um, he's going to be heading out to Seattle. And just arrived in, we have a Delta 737-900. Uh, he is going to be heading out to Minneapolis. United 757-200, he's got service out to Chicago O'Hare. United 737, he's going to be heading out to Houston Intercontinental later on today. Frontier A320, uh, he's going to be heading out to Las Vegas. And then finally for this update, we have the three 737-700s from Southwest. Um, I'm going to go through these in order from right to left. And these are the only 737s from Southwest that I can actually use at the moment since my 800 is broken and the maxes, as you know, are grounded. Now I'm actually recording this a bit ahead of time. So for all I know, the maxes could be back in service by now. That's gonna be the same until September. So for all I know at the moment, the maxes could be back in service in July and then I could just not be using them when I could do. Um, but here we have um, the first one on the right, we have a, a Southwest uh, one, uh, Heart livery. Um, 737-700, he's about to head out to Reno. And in the middle there, we have a Southwest uh, Triple Crown one livery. 737-700, he's gonna be heading out to Baltimore. And last but not least, on the end, we have a Southwest 737-700 in the uh, Canyon Blue livery, he's gonna be heading out to Burbank. And that is it for this update of San Jose um, International Airport. I hope you did enjoy it. It's quite an interesting airport. Again, just like Tampa, um, this is a very nicely sized airport. If any of you want to build San Jose, I would very much recommend it. Um, it's got a nice amount of international airlines as well as you know a good amount of domestic flights as well. Um, so there's British Airways, flies from here of course. We've got ANA. Uh, we also have Heinen. Heinen come here. Um, and then Hawaiian as well. Um, I think they're doing, they're probably doing the A321 Neo um, at the moment. Um, and then, of course, um, you have all of the usual, like American, United, and all the ones you've seen in this update as well. Um, so, yeah, that is, uh, as I've said, uh, it's been the update of San Jose. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to think of stuff to say because I feel like I've gone through that quite quickly. Um, I am actually, as a lot of you know, I'm pre-recording these updates um, now. So um, even though I won't be in America as you're seeing this, um, I've just started to pre-record um, all of the updates until September. So 
Again, um, if you didn't see my Tampa airport update, my sub routes will stop uh, now. Actually, by now, yeah, because I've gone through um, all the ones, uh, the previous ones from Dallas, Baltimore, and Reagan. So from now on, there won't be any sub routes until September. I do apologize for this, but um, just because I'm pre recording everything, it would be impossible for me to, you know, look into the future and see um, what people will leave as comments, you know, wanting uh, sub routes and all that. So I do apologize, um, but you know, I'm trying to get these airport updates out to you while I'm in America. Um, so I'm trying to backlog quite a lot. So hopefully, ideally, I can't promise it, but ideally I want to get enough so that um, every Friday there will be an airport update and then every Tuesday there will be a, um, a trip report because I'm also going on a lot of flights this summer. Um, but of course trip reports are quite, they take quite a long time to edit because um, I've got to write a script, then I've got to um, do a voiceover because my trip reports now have voiceovers and then I've got to actually edit it and upload it and all of that so I mean I'll try and get a trip report out weekly but also I'm staying with family as well so it's going to be a bit hard trying to find a place a quiet place to do um, voiceovers I mean I'm very I'm very excited to go over to America and see family and all that but it's just you know um, it's not the ideal place to be making videos um, like this anyway um, so yeah yeah anyway that has been the uh, update for San Jose um, I will have another suggested airport update in a month time now um, in a month time I will be in America so I believe this is gonna come out in a month so this is probably gonna come out uh, late June and then I actually leave actually this will probably this is the second to last airport update um, until I go to America so the next week's update I do plan on um, filming that update uh, in that week so that won't be a pre-recorded update um, so if you want any kind of like um, relative information on anything that's going on uh, don't look at these ones but the only update that you will see is the next Dallas one so next week's will be the last airport update and um, before I go to America um, that will come out on the Friday and I leave on the Monday um, to go to America um, so yeah I'm very psyched I'm you know pre-recording this is kind of psyching me up to go to America and I'm very excited so yeah thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video bye